So this could actually now be the end of Lyft. I don't know if you guys have been keeping track about what uh, everything going on in the um, the news and especially just with everything going on with Lyft. I mean, just as you can see today, the Lyft stock is down big. Um, you know, there's a lot of red in Lyft. So I always thought Lyft was kind of the underdog and, you know, with Uber, Uber has so much money and you know, their CEO makes what, $40 million a year. He has, a, his net worth is over 250 million bucks. He makes money off of drivers who, you know, basically work 80 hours a week with no overtime and they're living day to day, paycheck to paycheck. He's so out of touch with reality, but at the end of the day, Uber's doing really well. So today we're gonna talk about why I think Uber and uh, some of these other ride sharing companies are gonna beat out Lyft and Lyft is probably not gonna last very, very much longer. Um, before I do, I wanted to tell you guys, if you are looking for a new way to make money, you can get started by creating a faceless YouTube channel. It's a way that I've been making money for over five years uh, by doing YouTube and making a YouTube a faceless YouTube channel. Just last year alone, this is my whole year earnings from 2023 on one of my several YouTube channels, I made over $10,000 a month. I, and some days making over $1,000 a day. This is uh, one month I made over $20,000 on one channel, guys. And the craziest part, this is this year so far. Um, the craziest part, guys, is that you don't need a following to do this. You don't need to show your face. You don't need experience at all. I've taught one of my friends, she started making over $40,000 a month. She never showed her face one time. She never even showed her voice one time. It's absolutely insane, but this is what YouTube is. You know, people don't believe it, but you see YouTubers buying million dollar houses. The money's coming from somewhere. So I'm now showing people, you guys how to do it. Uh, you, with the link below, you can sign up. And once you log in, go to my programs and you'll see the course on how to set up a faceless YouTube channel. And then go under the group section and you can join the group where I'm actually interacting with you guys and helping you guys create your own channels. And not only that, but giving feedback along the way, giving you ideas, helping you. I'm gonna be shouting out some of you guys who, you know, start up a channel and help you get monetized, help you get that thousand followers at the beginning because that's the toughest part. As soon as you get monetized, then the money just starts flowing. So check out the link below. And right now there's a 30 day free trial. You can sign up, cancel at any time, but I know you guys are gonna wanna stay because it's epic. <laughs> is this crazy? I'm, I'm really excited to hopefully help some of you guys make life-changing money because for me, I was in massive credit card debt. I was in car debt. I paid that all off, bought this house. It's, it's crazy. Um, I'm actually about to go buy a car today, a new car, not a new car, a used car. Okay, here we go. Elon Musk, but, but, the, but the crazy thing is, is I'm buying it in cash. I'm buying the car in cash because I'm able to from YouTube money. It's crazy. Literally, it's becoming, and I'm buying it under as a company car, so it's uh, it's actually a pretty cheap car. It's only worth five thousand bucks, but still, to be able to buy it in cash is awesome. To not have to worry about a car payment. Okay, and then I'm gonna sell that car probably in like two to three years. My goal is so I'm buying it for fifty two hundred bucks. My goal is in two years or three years I can still sell it for four k. That's my goal, or or three k. Even if I can sell it for three thousand bucks. What, I only lost $2,000 in Descartes depreciation in three years? What is that, like 600 bucks a year? What, what would that be, uh, 50 bucks a month? Yeah, anyways, I'm rambling at this point. But well, the reason why I think um, Lyft's gonna end, well, Elon Musk, he just went to China uh, last week and he started talking about how he's going to be actually deploying robo-taxis in China. And why do I think this is interesting? Because Elon Musk, my friends, this man is somebody who does not back down, all right? He bought Twitter for what, $60 billion because, because he was, because he wanted to save free speech or because he was, he got into a fight with Jack Smith or, or Mark Zuckerberg. He, Ma Elon Musk wanted to do an MMA fight with Mark Zuckerberg, okay? Elon Musk is crazy. Elon Musk spent $60 billion to prove a point to buy Twitter. Do you think he's going to enter the ride sharing space and compete with Uber and Lyft and lose? No. Elon Musk entered the car space, which is arguably the, the most difficult space to enter 
and he's winning. All right, Tesla is at the top. It's the number one electric vehicle car. No matter if you listen to Joe Biden, though, it's at the very bottom. Ford and GM, oh yeah, they donate so much, they, so much money. They're lobbyists. Yeah, they don't even mention Tesla because Tesla doesn't donate money to the Biden administration like some of these other car companies do. Anyways, <laughs> I'm rambling, but Elon Musk, he's going to be entering the ride-sharing space, my friends, and Uber will probably survive. Uber, it'll probably be Uber and Tesla. If you want to take an Uber, all right, you can get a ride from somebody in a, you know, 2010 Honda Fit that's all beat up, or you want to take a ride share with Tesla and get a 2023 Model Y, <laughs> and it's probably, and I know for a fact, well, I don't know for a fact, but I have a very strong inkling that I think the Tesla is going to be a lot cheaper. I think because Elon Musk has so much money, I think he's going to say, all right, 50% off rides for the first year. What is Uber, what is Uber going to do? They're going to, they're going to suffer. What is Lyft going to do? They're probably going to go bankrupt because Uber, keep in mind guys, they have Uber Eats. They just partner with Instacart. They're already setting up to do you know, deliveries more so, where I don't think Tesla really cares about that. You know, they're more about doing the ride sharing space. So I think Tesla is gonna really compete with Uber and Lyft. I mean, they are starting in what, in August? That's less than three months away. And I think Uber will survive, but I don't think Lyft will. And I think Lyft is, you know, I think because Lyft did not do a good job at diversifying, into delivery and all these other avenues that uber is look how bad their stock has been doing since the very beginning it's always been going down 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 into the toilet so that's my little argument about why i think lyft will not be lasting very long let me know your thoughts with that my friends thank you so much for watching today's video and again if you want to sign up for the faceless youtube channel program and get that 30 day free trial that will only be available to the first 100 people who sign up. So sign up, make sure to be one of those first 100. Otherwise, we'll talk to you soon. Bye now.